So some of you guys probably know that I joined Roblox back in 2014, and right now it's already August 2019, it's basically been 5 years since I played Roblox. So, what I decided to do, is take a trip down memory lane, and we are going to play the very first Roblox game that I have ever played. And that is this game over here called The Query by this player named Dummies. So let's go ahead and head on into a server, and uh, I'll show you what exactly Roblox was like back in 2014. And if you guys remember, if you are an OG or something, you guys might have known 2014 was like the era of like all the murder games, like uh, the Mad Murder, the uh, Twisted Murder, and all that good stuff. But uh, the Murder Game was not my first game, and plus those games are all broken at this point, and they, they don't even work anymore due to Roblox updates. So uh, this game actually still is functional. So that's why I'm going to go ahead and head on in here, going to load in my profile, and let's take a look at where I last left off in here. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Alright, so you can see over here, I have like 220,000 mined, 3.44 million, I believe I have everything maxed out on here, maybe like the inventory or something like that's not really, but like the uh, most of them I have maxed out, and like uh, I still have all my ores here. I do have like some unobtainium as well. <laughs> I was looking through my uh, stuff earlier today and I was uh, just like uh, goofing around in this game and I managed to pull another unobtainium, so uh, now I have two unobtainiums and uh, I guess that's fine. So I'll go ahead and show you how uh, Roblox used to be back in 2014. So first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is come over here to the mine, because uh, obviously this is a mining game, it's kind of based off of like Minecraft in a way. So I found someone's a shaft mine over here, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, run on down in here, just going to fall through. Hopefully I don't glitch out of the map, because that would not be good. And of course, <laughs> we can glitch out of the map, because yeah, that, that tends to happen a lot. Okay, this game was notorious for causing people to just get poofed out of the map like that, alright? And uh, yeah, you can see we just got teleported back up here. Let's try this again. This time I'm gonna hug the edge of the uh, walls, and hopefully we're not gonna get glitched through the ground. Alright, here we go. Now we're going back into this mine. This time I'm gonna slowly go down here. I'm just gonna hold W against the wall because that increases like the friction and it makes you fall slower. So hopefully we don't fall in into the void again, okay? So don't make me fall into the void game. Don't you even dare think about it. That's called bacon abuse if you make me uh, get flung out over there. Um, uh, what? I just got ragdolled and upside down? That was weird. Okay, let's just uh, fall through the granite layer real quick because uh, we don't need to uh, farm any granite. I believe they added more layers, like, since the last time I played, because I played this game, like, last time in, like, 2015 or something like that. And, like, the deepest you could go was obsidian, and, like, it ended at, like, uh, like, I don't even remember. It was, like, 1600 something or something like that. But I heard they added, like, gold and emerald and stuff, uh, maybe even, like, uranium and, uh, amethyst after that. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be my first time taking a look at this game in ages. And, uh, yeah, I just got fallen, uh, way back down in here again. And remember, uh, Obsidian was notorious for having a ton of bedrock, and, uh, looks like it still does have a lot of bedrock, which is really, really annoying. Okay, I hate bedrock. It's, like, literally useless. You can't mine it, you can only blow it up and waste some, uh, TNT, dynamite, whatever it's called. So yeah, let's go ahead and just see if we can make it back down here, just follow this guy's mine, and I think uh, he ended up mining to, uh, to an end right over here. So let's go ahead and continue mining down, alright? So you can see over here we got like uraniums and like a bunch of random stuff. I'm gonna mine until we reach the uh, whatever layer I'm on. I believe I like finish at the diamond layer because you need like 300,000 blocks to mine that thing or something. I only have 200, like 220,000, something like that. So, uh, yeah, I think we're uh, fairly uh, deep down over here. Well, let's go ahead. We're currently at, like, almost a thousand. We got, like, a 600 to go. And, uh, yeah, we just gotta, like, mine over here, okay? So, when I'm mining down, like, in this game is, like, the complete opposite of Minecraft. Feel free to mine straight down as much as you want, right? <laughs> because, uh, yeah, I'll leave a link to the uh, game in the description down below. It's also quite easy to find on my uh, profile. It's in my favorites or something like that. So, uh, yeah, I can go ahead and go over there and find this game as well. Anyway, you can see over here we got a ton of bedrock, okay? I believe they added, okay, I think the mine's about to reset anyway so whenever the mine does reset they added like some uh, crazy like new feature that lets you like reduce the bedrock by like two-thirds or something like that so we'll have like a one-third of the bedrock remaining okay and uh, yeah so there's yeah obviously a ton of bedrock here oh we got some really juicy platinums here okay platinums are pretty pretty uh, rare in here I'd say like anything uh, uh, I don't know, tech type, platinum, that's probably like what's considered rare for me, and then like, uh, the super rare items are like Viridian, and like, yeah, I did play when Viridian was out, like, uh, when that thing came out, and I believe, uh, Unobtainium is like the rarest one, because it's obviously Unobtainium. When is Unobtainium, like, not rare, you know? <laughs> I mean, it's literally in its name. Okay, let's go ahead and just keep on going down here, I'll just, uh, skip through until we make it down to the uh, gold layer or something like that, and, uh, yeah. 
All right, finally, we are over here in the gold layer, okay? The, the obsidian layer was literally filled with bedrock. It was near impossible to go down without, like, running into bedrock every, like, four or five, like, uh, studs down. But now, finally, we're cruising along here, okay? Gold layer is notorious for not having any bedrock. It's, like, the only layer below obsidian that doesn't have any. And, uh, yeah, so every other layer does have bedrock. So that's why whenever this mine does reset in about like 5%, okay, there's like a tech tide or something up here, probably should uh, grab that thing real quick. Not sure if I did over there, probably were like way too low, but uh, that doesn't really matter, I'll go ahead and keep on mining down here. The uh, mine's about to reset anyway, so I really don't care how far I get down here, I'm just trying to get it to reset as fast as possible, so I can show you like the uh, new, uh, like less bedrock thing, because I really want to play in lo like low bedrock mode, because uh, low bedrock mode definitely uh, helps a lot, because uh, it's really annoying when you always run into unminable bedrock. Anyway, let's keep on just coming down here. It's already at like 96%. Okay, by the time I make it down to the sapphire layer, it's probably going to reset. So uh, yeah, here's this uh, tektite over here. Tektite is one of the rare ones. So the mine's already been mined at 99% of its capacity. Okay, this is not looking out great at all. It's going to reset at any moment now. Okay, it's going to give a message saying this like query is going to be unsafe and uh, we should probably head out. Okay, so I'm going to just keep on mining down here because it's automatically going to teleport us out. So uh, yeah, we're just currently inside of the uh, sapphire layer, uh, like right above the gold in like this area over here and i'm just gonna yeah you can see there's a message i'm just gonna keep on getting as like much ore as we can for like the last 15 seconds here before we get teleported out and we have to uh you know uh, get like the uh new mine and everything like that we gotta buy like all of our uh, products and stuff like that again and uh, yeah so let's just uh, keep on going through here there we go returning to the surface Holy cow. Okay, first thing I'm gonna go ahead and do is come over here and buy this stuff, okay? Because when I did play, this stuff wasn't even here. I need to see this for myself here because, uh, yeah, why not? And, uh, let's go ahead and just buy all three of them because I have the Robux to do it and I want to see what it's like, okay? And, uh, let's go ahead and go sell our stuff. I'm not gonna sell my unobtainium because I just want to keep it there. If you guys want me to sell it... Let me know in the comment section down below. If this video gets 20,000 likes or something like that, I might do it, okay? So if you want me to sell it, you know exactly what to do. Give me, like, a ton of likes and I'll do it. All right, let's go ahead and sell everything else over here, though. All right, so we just sold everything. The quarry has just been cleared again. Let's go ahead and go back and do some more mining, all right? I'm gonna show you how to get started here in case uh, you guys are complete noobs to this game. And for some reason, you find mining games like this enjoyable again, because it's certainly a lot of people do, because the Minecraft got popular again. But I do have insta mine inside of this game, and look how fast we're digging down, okay? This is like something I dreamed of back then. Like, back then, I didn't have insta mine, didn't have a single Robux at all, because, like, I was a broke bacon man. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it was a completely different experience. I can't really recreate it, like, you know, I can't disable game passes. I wish you could, like, temporarily disable game passes, just, like, try it out it would really help a lot in jailbreak i can do like starting over guides and stuff like that on my main account instead of having to, to create alts but uh yeah look how fast we are going out okay we are like so singing deep there's like one person over here that's like piggybacking long for the ride but we are mining all the way down here now the mine's gonna reset 140 percent instead of 100 percent which should give us a lot more time to uh you know just mine stuff okay hopefully i can make it down to the uh, diamond layer inside of the video and i'll show you like uh, how deep i can get i can't really show you the amethyst layer because i need like 500,000 mines but i'm gonna like know life this game for like a week or something hopefully i should be there and uh yeah i'll do another video like uh, maybe on the exact day that i joined roblox uh, playing this game or something like that again and uh, yeah so currently we're inside of obsidian and i have not seen a single bedrock holy cow that game pass for really does help a lot and uh, yeah okay finally we reached the bedrock holy cow definitely a lot less bedrock inside of this mine than last time okay and hopefully uh, i think it feels like a lot less laggier as well okay because less people are in here there's less blocks mine and we can just quickly get down to our target layer as fast as we can so so far this mine has been pretty smooth to a mine there's like a lot less bedrock like i said because we bought the uh, game pass thing a jig up there at the surface gold layer has like relatively no uh, bedrock whatsoever so i'm just gonna like keep on mining through here and i'll see you guys hopefully when i reach the next layer down here all right so now we just entered the uh, sapphire layer now the sapphire layer will have a few uh, bedrocks here i've been in here earlier just to see how the uh, game actually works so i have a general idea of what to uh, do here there we go we just encountered our first bedrock inside of this layer and let's go ahead and keep on mining here this time i'm going to just skip over to ruby layer i believe that's what's after the sapphire layer we're going to go straight into emerald layer and end up at the surface of the diamond layer uh oh guys we just fell out of the map again <laughs> and you can see it just ends up like right over here 
at the base here, alright? So that means what we gotta do is we gotta go back to the surface and find our way back through all those tunnels until we end up back here, alright? It's gonna take a while and hopefully we don't get flung out on the map again. I should have placed my checkpoint up there earlier, but, uh, you know, I was kind of being a little bit greedy and, like, trying to get down to the bottom as fast as possible, okay? But looks like our mine over here is, like, the only shaft here, so I'm just gonna go ahead and just jump right down here and go all the way into the obsidian layer. Alright, guys, we're finally back here. We have just entered the emerald layer. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is come over here and place a checkpoint here, because now, if I ever get flung out of the map, all I have to do is click go to checkpoint and now will uh, teleport me over here. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead, dig straight down through the emerald layer, and hopefully we're gonna reach the diamond layer without getting, uh, hopefully too many bedrocks, alright? So, uh, let's go ahead and just keep on mining here, and finally, we are here at the top of the diamond layer, where I need about, like, uh, 300,000, I believe, to go continue. Currently at, uh, let's see, 225,000, okay? So we need 75,000 more before I can enter the uh, diamond layer fully. But I guess now is a good time to show you, uh, what I usually do to a uh, farm ores. I just go around this, uh, the lowest layer I can, and just, uh, you know, just circle around here, just gonna, like, uh, you know, just form random caves and just, uh, strip mine out into the, uh, open, this area, yeah, just keep on going in this direction, and generally, find a ton of ores here, we got, like, some uraniums, which aren't that valuable once you get to my level here, but, like, you can, uh, you can just keep on farming them, and I'm just gonna keep on grinding through here, okay, we got, like, a tech tight there, the tech tights look really similar to bedrocks, especially from far away, but, uh, you know, just hover over the bedrocks just in case. If they aren't red, then they are, uh, a tech titan. You will get them, alright? So, uh, yeah. Yes, yeah, so we're just gonna keep on mining around here until our inventory fills up. And then we're gonna go teleport to our checkpoint and then move the checkpoint back down here. Because I did not get flung out of the map, which is perfect. And then now down here, you just see there's a ton of diamond. I'm gonna get super duper rich by farming all of this diamond here. I believe the far bottom layer, you get to, uh, like, amethyst and, like, uranium. But you need, like, 500,000 to, uh, get that. So, uh, one day I'll get there and, uh, it's gonna be money, money, money money, 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 all right, so you can see I've definitely made it, like, uh, very, very far into the game since, uh, 2014 when I first played this thing, when I first started, I had, like, nothing, no Robux, I was a complete bacon hair, should have dressed up as a stock bacon hair for this, but, like, I mean, this is close enough, you know, it's still bacon hair, it's like a slightly modified bacon man, but, like, you know, it's still a bacon man, and, uh, yeah, bacon hair has been out since pretty much, like, the year I joined, all right, so, uh, been out for five years at this point, a lot of people still underestimate bacon hairs for some reason, I honestly don't see the point of that, Anyone can make an alt account and start over and pretend to be a noob and uh, yeah And plus a lot of bacon hairs at this point have like over five years of experience like under their belts now okay? Because bacon hairs were released like a uh, beginning of like summer of 2014 It was like May or something like that if I remember correctly and I joined in August 2014 So obviously I had bacon hair since I started and uh, yeah, so don't underestimate bacon hairs Let's just uh, keep on mining through here. You can see uh Holy cow, we made it quite far. Uh, there's like some amethyst over here. We got like a, uh, uh, what's that, a platinum? Yeah, there's a lot of platinums over here. We just keep on doing this and I'll show you the unobtainium right here if you guys have stuck around. I do have the place block and this is what unobtainium looks like. It is like this blue sparkly thing that looks a lot like the uh, bedrock except it's slightly bluer and I should probably mine it before uh, the uh, thing resets because we're already at like 90% something like that, alright? But holy cow, now we're over here like so far away from where we started. I'm just going to keep on doing this. Look how many diamonds we have. We have like a thousand diamonds already. This is absolutely insane. There's so many uh, platinums around here. This game is like, I don't know, it's still pretty fun for me because like it was like the first game I ever played and like back then you literally like this was the type of Roblox game. You literally had a just one thing and you did it over and over again like mad murder if you guys remember it was like that there was like an og jailbreak game as well that's like completely broken by roblox updates as well it's like role playing kind of ish but like a turn-based jailbreak you had to like escape the warden or something like that i don't exactly remember it but like it was pretty cool back then i remember playing it for a little bit so yeah i guess that's basically it for uh, playing my uh, very very first game i've ever played on roblox here which is called a dquery if you guys want to uh, play it i'll leave a link in the description or a pinned comments or something if like that if I do remember and uh, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this you guys know exactly what to do hit like comment subscribe If you want to try out this game check it out in the description down below and I'll see you guys next time